Yeah, it's really cool. And what made you join Robbie Gordon's team in 2008? Um, uh, I was actually with Robbie in 2004 when he started his team. Oh. Uh, I was actually employee number two. And oh. it was just a, um, uh, back when he had the Fruit of the Loom car. Fruit of the Loom. And to be honest, Robbie just pressured me to come back and He's a good guy, but he's a very difficult person to work for. Yeah, I've heard that. The other day I spoke to Tommy Kendall, and he told me a similar thing about Robbie. <laughs> yeah. What was... So, I mean, oh, go ahead. Just a great, great person, but just um, it's a little difficult in the race to work for. Yeah. What was your reaction when you led Robbie to a top 10 at Daytona in 2008? Uh, it was good. I mean, it was pretty cool. Jim Dean was there. Actually, Fred Nell, the, uh, the head of the store for Jim Dean was there. And, um, I don't know. I mean, you know, I, we were at second at Watkins Glen that year. Um, and that's a good run. It's just hard, again, back then, a single-car team being a cup, cup team. Yeah, it's kind of tough, especially being an owner-driver. That's even yeah. tougher, too. Did your controversial penalty at the beginning of 2008 play any role in your departure from the team or no? No, not really. Okay. No. Just, uh, I'd rather stay friends with the enemies and go work somewhere else on that. Yeah, that makes sense.